everybody, Cass here, and today we're taking a look at subsistence. This is supposed to be a really hardcore uh, survival crafting game. I guess there's like multiplayer and stuff. What is that? What what iron ore can be refined in iron? Cool. Um, as you can see, I started a little bit. I thought I had started the recording, but I didn't. So here we are. Um, what I figured out so far is that we need to do all this stuff. So we harvest logs, fibers, cordage, planks, build foundation walls, and then this base command unit. Uh, I know exactly zero about this game other than the fact that I've been playing it for about five minutes and found out that wolves are dicks. Um, so we'll just stick there. Now harvest fibers. I don't know what the hell a fiber looks like. Is this a fiber? Oh, that is a fiber. Okay. So they look like little cotton plants. What's this? Unlock. What is that? Gunpowder? Well, don't mind if I do. I don't see a carry weight mechanic. Um, I, I could be just missing it, but I think it's just a numerical inventory. I think. You know, you can only hold like... 1, 2, 3, 7, 14, 21, 20, 35 things. Maybe there's an upgrade for that later, but what? Uh, we only have one fiber, so we need more fiber. Okay, there's a bear. There's a wolf with 105 health. Uh, let's go up this way. I wonder, what's this tree? Oh, shit, that's a rabbit. Okay. Um, okay, so there's some wood. Wood. Okay, so the big trees give you a lot more wood. That's good to know. Oh, and a grub. Oh, I can eat it. Okay, we'll eat it. Okay, can I get... Oh, nope, that wolf is coming straight towards me. Okay, we're gonna go this way. There's a there's a box right there on the edge of that rock. Right underneath that tree, if you can see it. But that wolf is right there. And, uh... Yeah, I don't want to, uh... Don't want to screw the wolf, not gonna lie. There he is. Um, so let's see... Oh, here's one up here. There's no, like, spear or anything. Oh, there's a bear. Let's grab... Oop. Okay, and there's some scrap metals. Wasn't one of the things I needed that required a lot of scrap metal? Oh, never mind. Ah... <sighs> Then we need wooden plank. Let's craft one of those really. Actually, let's craft two of those really quick. Can I get out of my inventory? Oh, that's awesome. I can get out of my inventory and keep going while I'm crafting. What can I say? I'm a multi-talented man. Um, oh, okay. That was the sound of... Um, let's just make the rest of those then because we're supposed to craft five planks anyway. So we'll do that. We're still looking for fiber. I just... I don't know if it only grows in certain areas, or... Oh, here's another box. Look around, make sure there's nothing gonna eat me. Lockpick required. But I have a lockpick. See? Is this actually gonna work? Nope. Okay, let's go up to this one then. Oh wait, I think I saw fiber. Uh, right there. Two, three. Aha! What's this? What's this? Scrap metal. Okay. I hope I don't lose my inventory when I die, and I do say when I die because uh, this game's brutal. You notice my health down in the right-hand corner. That was a wolf bit me, 
uh, right at the, like I spawned and there was a wolf right there. And I didn't even know the controls yet. And the bastard bit me. Gunpowder and bullets. So go here and load all that. So it's got three rounds in it, okay. I can go up into the snow. I have a feeling that I need clothes first because I'm wearing pants. Um, <laughs> I'm literally only wearing pants. What's it take? Uh, is that leather? That's cloth. So, cordage and cloth. Get some more, um... Get some more fiber, I guess. That fiber right there? No, that's medicinal herbs. But you know what? I'm probably gonna end up needing that too. Does anybody else hear anything? Oh, uh... All right, this would be the first survival game I've played in a long time where I couldn't outrun a chicken. Which is a nice touch for realism, not gonna lie. Okay. Gonna grab that. I don't even know where I'm going. Uh, the map isn't all that clear and the way it zooms out freaks me out, so. There's something on the other side of this mountain. I wonder if this is a, like a, an island or if it's a little like islet or something. I don't know. <sighs> oh, uh, there's another box. Look around, make sure there's nothing around here. Sorry, I'm not shaking my, um, accidentally ran over my thumb with my mouse, so it got stuck for a second. All right, so we got that. What are we working with food-wise? We need fruits and vegetables, hydration, and protein, so let's eat two of those, and that gave us... Surprisingly, that gave us a lot of fruit and vegetable. What's this? This is fat, and this is raw steak, and it doesn't look like there is a spoilage mechanic right now. Um, but we'll see. Okay, some more of those. Wait a second, can I craft lockpicks? Tools, campfire stick, fishing tackle, hammer, animal trap. Whoa, did everybody just hear that? That could have just been a glitch in the, uh, a glitch in the sound file, but it all of a sudden got very, uh, resonant. It almost sounds like there's a fire nearby. Like the slight roar of a fire. Okay, there's a bear. Let's not screw with a bear. Oh, there's some fiber. Fiber! Okay. I have half of the fiber that I need. Jeez, this is taking forever. I understand why this game is hard or considered hard now. Um, other than the fact that the animals kind of kicked my ass right at the very beginning, I, uh... Oh, shit. <laughs> that is a wolf. I wonder if you can tame them. Like, if you can have a... have a wolf as a companion or something. Probably not, but, uh... It's worth thinking about, I guess. Oh, there's a, uh, crate. And I don't see any... Okay, unlock. Uh, what's that? Arrows? Okay. But I still don't have what I need to craft this, right? Because I need sticks and cordage, but I also need cordage for 
for the foundation. Um, oh, geez, there's a lot of these crates right here. Okay. Lots of gunpowder. Holy crap. Um, oh, shit. Oh, it's a rabbit. Sounded like a damn snake. What is that? Is that cinnabar ore? All right. Fine. Be that way. I should probably make a pickaxe. Okay. That was copper ore. Okay. That is not the color of copper ore. Just so you're all aware. I've mentioned it once and I will mention it ad nauseum. Geologist. That's not what malachite looks like most of the time. In fact, if it looks like that, it's because you just pour off the top layer that it really should look like. Okay. So I'm noticing in the bottom left-hand corner that uh, it is saving pretty constantly. So this game seems very unforgiving. Um, I don't... I think I'm actually at the end of where I can go. I will freeze to death, I'm sure, if I go up into the colder climbs. So, let's see what we're working with. Okay, I don't like that this is inverted. You have to hold right click and then do like this weird scan to do it. So we're gonna go up along this ridge and then come up and over to that thing, I guess. And we're just gonna really hope that there's no animals, uh, Hey, other than the freaking rabbits that keep scaring the crap out of me. Because it's not like a warning thump. Like, jackrabbits and, and certain species of rabbits, they have this warning thump that they do. To let you know that you're getting too close and making them nervous. It's not like a warning thump. It's just like they sound like freaking snakes. Okay, puppy. You stay down there. And we all stay happy and alive okay now I run this way first check up slope and then down and then back and forth and I see something down there that I want to go check out but it's way too close to the wall it's too close for comfort Uh, let's see. Oh, I see some, uh... I see some fiber. Woo! All right. We're doing all right. Doing all right. I think. Maybe. Maybe not. Gonna get eaten by a wolf here in a minute. I just know it. Okay. Oh, shit. I was kind of joking, but yeah, there's a wolf right down there. So we're going to go this way. Mountain stream from the source. Cool. Okay, I'm probably freezing to death. Because uh, it's seven degrees outside. Let's get just a little more wood because I need to craft some more planks and stuff. If I'm going to build a bow. Hell, I don't even know if I'll get around. So the bow needs some sticks and some cordage. So let's one, two, or one, two, three. So got enough of that there. That's a big ass bear. Oh, I'm probably also gonna need arrows. Hit? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Not paying attention here. I, I like the solution to the lag problem that the developer has. Oh, sorry, didn't mean to hiccup. I like the solution to the lag problem that the developer has come up with. He made it so that the nodes are um, permanent. 
The nodes stay here, so I can't actually remove that tree, it seems. But it still gives resources, so that's kind of an interesting solution. Um, let's go this way, and let's find a flat area near, like, water to set up shop, I think. What, how much... Um... Cordage, two, four, six, eight. So I need two more. I wonder, and I know this is probably a weird thing to say, but I am constantly interested in how developers make AIs interact. I know that sometimes, I, I know it's more complex than what I'm about to say, but sometimes it is as simple as saying, the deer are part of Team 2, or Team Prey, and the wolves are part of Team 1, or Team Predator, or whatever. And then they just tell them to be enemies. I realize that sometimes it's that simple. But it makes me wonder if, like, the wolves will actively hunt down a deer that runs past them, or if it's just all the deer are afraid of the player and the wolves eat the player kind of interaction. But, anyway, uh... I can stop running now for a moment. And... Fiber, fiber, fiber. Where are you at? You guys are probably yelling at me in the comments that I'm, like, walking past a ton of it, but I don't see it. And I'm not turning down the graphics setting or anything, because I think it's pretty. Plus... You know, it's the legit way to play the game. The devs put lots of time and effort into making this look the way that it does, and I have a rig that will run it that way, so I should respect the dev and all their hard work by running it at that resolution. Besides, I've never had a performance hit from a graphic setting. Not in an appreciable amount. Okay, is this a cave? It is not a cave, unless I can dig. Nope. Because it would be really cool to have a cave. Okay. There's a wolf. Fiber. Fiber. Oh, there's a vest up here. With more stuff in it that I don't know what to do with yet. Huh. Okay. We're gonna have ourselves a fight here in a second if that wolf comes running at me. Nope. Okay, and I am out of stamina. But we're just gonna meander our way this way. It seems like the rolling hills or more plain-like area is where, um where I was finding the cotton plants before. At least that's what they appear to be. Um, they're at least modeled after cotton plants, whether they are that or not. Hmm. Don't see. I don't see anything. I'm sure you guys see everything everywhere, but. I see copper. And that's a bear. That's a bear. That's a bear. I don't care if there was two things of fiber back there. That was a bear. Okay. Fiber. Oh, shit. Okay, so the animals do give you an indication that you're pissing them off. You get a little growl or something. 
that indicates that you done fucked up. Um, it's not much, and if you're running full speed, it doesn't really help, but, like, there's another bear. Is there a wetness mechanic? Because if there is, I'm now wet. I was really hoping to have something to live in by the time the sun went down. There's a wolf and a bear and a body of water. Is there? There is not a mechanic. So you're Stamina just comes back really, really slowly. Which is fine. But it also... Wait. Oh, I'm hungry. Uh... Rotten meat. I don't think that's edible. Oh, I'm only a little hungry. I know. It's horrible to say in any situation, but... I'm only a little hungry. Damn it, be food. Okay. It's kind of a nice little spot right here. I'm sure I'll regret the decision, but if I walled off that... I don't even know if I could build walls, and I walled off that. Um, that might work. Oh, crap. I still don't have enough fiber. It's not usually the kind of fiber a guy my age is complaining about, either. Jeez. Come on. I wonder how long the days are in this. Now, ooh, that's horrible. Can't see a damn thing. Except for this glowing green... I can't say that word on YouTube. So, where are we? Oh, great. The map turns dark at night, too. We're close. Uh, that thing is over there on the other side of the lake, so... I'm going to sit down for just a moment. I'm going to drink some water. I'm going to... Can I build a campfire? Fire starting kit. Fibers. Of course, I need more fibers. Blue is a horrible color for night related activities. Ugh. That's a bear. Okay. Yeah, I'm too cold. No shit. I don't know... Just probably gonna die of exposure. Yeah. I'm wet, I'm hungry, and I'm gonna die. Now, for those of you who might be wondering, 
in a survival situation, there is something, it's, I think it's called the rule of threes. And basically what it is, is that you can only survive three minutes without shelter. Three, three minutes without shelter, three days without water and three weeks without food. Three minutes without shelter or oxygen, three days without water, and three weeks without food. And so your first priority should always be to, um, well, keep yourself dry and warm and safe. I have no idea where I'm going or what this thing is over here, so it's probably going to kill me. Um, but I don't have anything else to go on. There's not a lot of tutorial in the game. That makes it kind of nice. Let me throw this thing. It doesn't help. I guess my only hope... Oh, wait. Fiber. Ah! Fiber. Make a fire start kit, damn. Okay. Whew. I think we might live. I think. That's a bear, damn it. What do I... Can I... Do I put it down? Okay, that's what I do. Um... How do I... I'm a retard. Alright, I am not very smart. I found the campfire... Finally, what what is that? Eight? Okay, so we put that there. And then we What do I I I ignition? Haha. -ha. And fuel. Uh ignite. We have fire. Look. Oh wait. Damn it! The meat that I had spoiled. There's nothing I can do for that. Well, it'll keep me warm. And now that we have this tree nearby, I think this is the one that gave us the worm earlier, so... I'm not gonna die of exposure! Yay! I'm just gonna die of my own stupidity. Let's see, can I cook the grub? Can't cook the grub. But, let's see, can I split half? Perfect. Put this in here. Awesome. Fishing pole. I need cordage and sticks. Well, so, craft craft. If I had cordage, I wouldn't be suffering from... Um... Hypothermia, anyway. Let's... Okay. That was too cold. So we gotta stay close to the fire. How close? Oh. Cool. So it gives me a little percentage. If you look over on the right side, it gives me a little percentage. I'll see if I can zoom in on it. Uh, it gives me a little percentage that shows how close to the fire I am. I bet you 100% if I stand right here. Oh, but the sun's coming up. I think. What did that bear just do? Did you see it like scrape its paw and dig some dig it something? Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm starving. Eat. Well, 
Well, it's a little bit of protein. It's not a terrible amount. I'm gonna have to hunt something at some point. Ooh. Fiber, grab that, perfect. I don't understand. It's... Okay, we're going this way. Because it's now warm enough that we're not going to starve to death. And so we have to go basically right over there. I think I see something, but I'm not sure. What's... Uh, some ferns. Yeah, those are just ferns, and those don't give me anything, so they're useless. Ooh, I am malnourished. No shit. Pick kelp in lakes for easy food? Well, all right. No shit, this is scary. Where do I get kelp? There is no kelp, jackass. Now, thank you game for telling me there was hope only to have it taken away. I appreciate it. Protein. Is that I'm lacking? Oh, geez, I'm lacking vegetables too. Okay. Can I? Oh, wait. Uh, I can. Nope, I cannot. Wonder if there's a headshot mechanic in the game. Uh, so gonna die. So gonna die. Okay, give me the grub. Okay, this way. Is that fiber? Negative. There's a fiber. A whole one. Let's grab that. Uh, okay. So I've got the cordage. Wait, I have five cords. Dipshit. Craft the foundation. Oh, it hadn't finished crafting the um, cordage. Whoops. Sorry, not sorry, game. See, here's the thing. I appreciate what the game is trying to do, but malnourishment does not kill you that quickly. Anyway. Yeah, there we go. I'm dead. Oh no. <laughs> Your dropped kit will despawn in 14 minutes. Okay. Are you kidding me? Well, that cave is now under the water, so we're good there, and there's my death point. So, 
holy crap we really hauled ass all the way across the map well, <laughs> well it wasn't the most exciting video but if you did enjoy like subscribe all those fun things let me know if you'd like to see more and we can dig into this game a little more in depth join me over on twitter and discord uh it shows support for the channel and doesn't cost you a thing so it's very much appreciated and very easy to do Join me over at patreon.com forward slash control alt silent if you're feeling particularly generous. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.